Ahoy there, pirates! A mirror or one falcon, here for Mare Thief. You can now find the extravagant King's Chest, the elaborate King's Bounty Skull, and the Royal Crown of Hope throughout the Sea of Thieves. Selling enough of these treasures will complete the Treasures Fit for a King commendation and unlock some of the lavish Cartographer cosmetics. However, you won't encounter these kingly treasures on any voyage or world event. You'll need to scan the horizon, scour the beaches, and venture off the beaten path to find them. So what exactly are these kingly treasures and where can you find them? The King's Chest is a high-value gold hoarder's chest. The King's Bounty Skull is a high-value Order of Souls skull. And the Crown of Hope is a high-value gold hoarder's trinket. You can find kingly treasure in the hulls of emergent shipwrecks and quests from messages in a bottle. However, you can also find King's Bounty Skulls from emergent skeleton captains, including Ashen Guardians. Shipwrecks, messages in a bottle, and skeleton captains can all appear randomly across the Sea of Thieves. To find a shipwreck, look for a large flock of seagulls circling above the open water as you sail the sea. If you spot one, dive beneath the seagulls to find an emergent shipwreck. Inside, you might find a kingly treasure. To find a message in a bottle, search every beach for a green bottle sticking out of the sand. You can also find messages in a bottle floating in shipwrecks. Once you find one, interact with it to see what type of quest you receive. An X marks a spot quest will direct you to an island with buried king's chests that you can dig up. A bounty quest will send you to an island with wanted skeleton captains that can drop king's bounty skulls upon defeat. And a riddle quest will take you to an island to solve a riddle that leads to a treasure chest containing crowns of hope. As for finding skeleton captains and ashen guardians, you'll want to scan the beach of every island you pass. Like messages in a bottle, they usually hang out on the shoreline, so you don't need to look for them in the middle of islands. Skeleton captains and ashen guardians have an orange title above their head, making them easy to spot from a distance. Killing a skeleton captain will reward you with a wrathful King's Bounty Skull, and killing an ashen guardian will reward you with an ashen King's Bounty Skull. After you find some kingly treasure, you can sell the King's Chest and the Crowns of Hope to the Gold Hoarders, and the King's Bounty Skulls to the Order of Souls. And of course, you can sell any of them to the Reaper's Bones or the Sovereigns. Both a King's Chest and a Crown of Hope are worth about 3,100 gold, and their Ashen variants are about 3,800. A Wrathful King's Bounty Skull is worth about 5,100 gold, and an Ashen King's Bounty Skull is worth about 5,800 gold. So, the next time you see a shipwreck, message in a bottle, or a skeleton captain during your voyage, it'll be worth your time to change course and recover the riches. If you have any questions, comments, or interesting stories from your hunt for kingly treasure, be sure to leave a comment below. See you on the sea, pirates!